Welcome to Black Children's Books Read Aloud. Sunny Discovers Holes The Adventures of Sunny, written by Evelyn and Yvette Davis. Hello, my name is Sunny. I am a happy two year old boy who loves playing with my pet poodle Chip. I love to play with Chip because he is small, just like me. Sunny is very curious. Do you know what that means? Curious means that Sunny likes to learn and discover things. Sunny is very curious about holes. Sunny likes to look inside of them. Sunny has learned many things about holes that are different and interesting. Sunny wants to share this with you. When I dig holes in Mama's flower bed, many creatures jump out from the soil. There are long, wiggly worms and all kinds of crawly bugs with lots of legs. Animals make holes in the ground for when they get sick or when it gets too cold. I guess they lay there where nothing can bother them until they feel better or weather gets warmer. The dirt keeps them warm like a blanket. When the men with big trucks dig into the ground, they put pipes underground with big holes in them. They are so big, I can crawl through them and come out on the other side. Sometimes, Mama makes pies and punches holes in the crust. Out of the oven comes hot, juicy, syrupy goodness. Yummy. Snakes live inside of holes in the middle of the tree. Squirrels bury nuts in holes in the ground to eat later in the winter. Junior puts nickels, dimes, and pennies in a jar through a narrow hole in the top. Some people call this jar a piggy bank, but it doesn't look like a pig and does not have as much money as a bank. Sissy puts dirty clothes in a hole that has a door. The clothes come out of the hole on the other side in the laundry room below. When the ceiling has a hole from a leaky roof, Daddy fills the hole with plaster. Holes, holes, holes! Holes are everywhere. There are holes in the sides of your head. I have those too, but I can't see what's inside. Neither can I see where the holes in my nose go. When Chip barks, he shows the hole in his mouth. There are holes in my jacket for my arms. Sometimes holes get in my socks, but I don't know how. They are never there when my socks are new. Some holes let things go through, like a needle, a donut, or a pipe. Some holes keep things from going through, like a pocket, a cave, and a light bulb socket. Most holes are friendly holes because they don't make me feel afraid. But there is one hole that I don't like very much. In fact, I don't like that hole at all. No, sir. I don't want to have anything to do with that hole. Can you guess where that hole is? That hole is scary. Things disappear in it and are never seen again. I don't care what anyone says. Sunny is smart and Sunny is never going to sit on that hole. Sunny might go down the hole and never ever come out. Nothing ever does. I can't see where anything comes out on the other side or is it held in like a pocket. Things just go around and around and around and then they disappear. Like my sock and cookie and peas and tissue and play-doh and everything that I put in that toilet. No sir, Sunny is too smart to go in that hole. I'll never use that toilet, even if Mama thinks it's time for Sunny to use the potty seat. I'll just find a safe hole in Mama's garden for my poop, just like Chip does. Make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. 
Most importantly, please support the author by purchasing their book. Until next time.